Hey everybody, it's Brian, and I'm not going to cover any tutorials today. Uh, really, this is just the unveiling of my website. Um, go to www.voidrealms.com, that's V-O-I-D-R-E-A-L-M-S.com, and this is my new website in all its glory. And I'm sorry the, uh, the window is a little bit small. Um, it takes me quite a bit of bandwidth to upload these videos so I try to keep the windows small so the recording area is pretty small but anyways this is my new website now why should you care well as you know I've been doing a lot of tutorials I write a lot of source code and I do like programs so you know the home page is just the home page and I've got this little interactive menu thingy um, downloads I have some programs that I've written and you can kinda go in and get a little more uh, insight you see screenshots of the programs, get a description, things of that nature. You know, just typical shareware, freeware stuff. Source code. Um, I'm going to start uploading source code for just about everything I can think of. Like right here is a C sharp encryption class that uses um, AES 256 bit. I mean, this is military strength encryption right here, and I'm literally just giving the class away for free. I actually spent quite a bit of time working on this class. But um, I try to give example source code on how to use stuff whenever possible just to make life easy. And you notice the download source code now. And this is why you guys should care. Tutorials. Yes, every single tutorial I have done on YouTube is in here. Now, some of these don't have any source code. Like if you click on C++, you notice it's just the YouTube video that I've recorded. Where if we go back, let's go to the cute tutorials. And let's actually go to the last one here. Or actually, let's just search. Remember, there was that uh, really good tutorial we did on encryption with Botan Library. Um, well, if you click on that, you notice there's a download the source code button. And what I've done is actually the source code for the tutorials that I've typed out, I've saved and packaged it up. And in this case, I've also packaged up the compiled Botan DLL. So if you want the already written source code, it's out there. Now, granted, it's not for everything. I admittedly didn't think this was going to take off, so I didn't save all my source code. Shame on me. So if you're looking for like uh, the Java source code or some of the Visual Basic, I'm sorry, I just don't have it. Um, if you have it, uh, definitely email it to me in zip format. Do not email me an executable because virus scan will just strip it right off and I'll never even see the message. It'll be like you never sent it. But uh, yeah, if you've got the source code for some of these, send it to me. Uh, zip it up, just send it. Give me a little note for what video it's for so I don't have to figure it out. And in here, you can actually search, um, like I've got view all. So you can say array. And then it shows you, you know, which tutorials have the word array. Or you can narrow it down, like you can go into Java and then type in, uh, let's just say class. And then, you know, kind of narrows things down for you. And same thing with source, too. It searches the same way. Uh, projects, my pet project, Laptop Locator. I don't know if I've even remotely talked about that. I've written a... Actually, let's just crack it open real quick. That way I don't sound like a raving lunatic here. I wrote a freeware application called LaptopLocator.net. There you can uh, install this on your laptop, and if your laptop's ever stolen, you can use this tool to find your laptop. So it's absolutely free for personal use, etc., etc. Um, kind of leads me back into my website and the purpose of it, which I'll cover here in just a second, I promise. And then, of course, my YouTube videos, which that link just pops open to my, ta-da, my YouTube channel, which you guys are probably all very familiar with. And then uh, web design, you know, that's some of the websites that I've done in the past with a little, you know, you can click on it, make it bigger sort of thing. Now, there is a donate button, and if you've kind of skipped ahead and you've gone out to tutorials, and let's just go to Qt, and let's just find one that's got... Uh, got a source code in here. Hmm. Most of the source code's at the end, so let's just go here. Let's say you just want to download this. You notice how it pops open this annoying window that says donate now. Well, the reason why is this site is now 100% funded by donations, meaning I'm not going to charge a dime for my source code. I'm not going to charge a dime for the programs that I write and put out here. I just throw it out free of charge. Now, because it's all free of charge, it comes with absolutely no warranty or guarantee of any kind, as you would expect. Um, I do not, I'm going to repeat, I do not expect any donations from anybody. 
donations are strictly for if you're a business and you use my products my code my tutorials etc etc and I'm making money for you I would appreciate a donation and it just says you know if you're a business or you just really like the stuff then all I ask is you make a donation for the amount you feel this software or whatever is worth so if you go to the site and you go to download the source code don't get disgruntled when you see the donate now because I don't expect a dime from you I'm just doing this because I want to do it but if you feel inclined to donate you just click and then it's via PayPal I know some people hate PayPal some people love it there's my little smiley face and then uh, of course my contact page with my uh, beautiful not smiling face that's probably most I usually smile and a little bit about me some of my credentials you know, I'm a, a CISP a certified ethical hacker uh, Microsoft certified IT professional enterprise administrator and the list goes on and on and on and I'm, I've got a lot of certifications behind my name so uh, Anyways, just wanted to drop a note. That's my website and it's totality. And uh, just wanted to share with you guys that if you're going through some of these tutorials, you can go out, especially if they're the newer ones, the cute, you can usually find the source code out here. And if you have been following along with my videos, like uh, the C++ Hello World, I don't have the source code for this. I'm sorry. I just don't. But if you have it, please zip it up and send it to me. Say, hey, Brian, this is for uh, C++02 Hello World, you know. Anyways, thanks for watching. I wanted to thank you guys for your continued support. I, I love hearing from you guys. I love helping people. And a couple of you out there have actually helped me a lot with some of my own personal projects. So uh, kudos to everybody, and thank you for watching.